Step one, wake up early, gon' rise in the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, you grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please stand and join me for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. And now join me for the Tiger Pledge. Today, I will try my best, imagine my possibilities and give respect. I will be eager to learn, realize my worth and smile every day. Our guidelines for success go like this. Focus, focus on the positive. Intent, practice positive intent. Safety, keep it safe. Helpfulness, be helpful to others. Encouragement, you can do it. Respect, show respect to others and myself. And now for a moment of silence. to sing the school family song you are my family my school family i feel happy when you are here i hope you know friends how much i love you we're a part of you here on espanol familia somos in la escuela estoy feliz cuando están aquí quiero decirles cuánto los quiero cuando no están los llevo aquí now it's time to wish well so look around your classroom and see who in your school family is not here today. Let's put them in our hearts and let's wish them well. We wish you well. We wish you well. All through the day today. We wish you well. Deseamos lo mejor. Deseamos lo mejor. Todo el día de hoy. Deseamos lo mejor. And then send out all your love and well wishes. Today is the day to start becoming a super safe digital citizen. Think about your favorite superhero. What are some of the things that make them a superhero? Spider-Man's motto, with great power comes great responsibility. A superhero digital citizen is someone who uses technology responsibly to learn, create, and participate. Every one of us can be a superhero digital citizen Digital citizen superheroes who use their great powers to help people act safely, responsibly, and respectfully online. Let's watch this great video.
sense says we can all be superheroes each and every day. What are your superpowers? Here are five internet safety tips for kids. Number one, don't give out personal information such as home address, school name, or phone number. Number two, never send pictures to strangers. Number three, keep passwords private except from parents. Number four, don't download anything without permission. It may contain a virus that can harm your computer. And number five, tell an adult if you receive a mean or strange message. For more tips, visit us at commonsense.org. We're going to talk about problem solving. But before we talk about it, we're going to watch a short video. Gotta get to school. I never should have stopped and picked all those blueberries. Whoa! Hunter, what's going on? Look at that flooded creek. I'm done for. This is a big problem. I give up. Wait a minute. Let's talk this through and make sure we understand the problem. Maybe we can come up with a solution. Well, the problem is that because of all the rain, I can't safely cross the flooded creek and get to school. Okay, now that we understand the problem, let's see if we can come up with some solutions for getting to school safely. Hmm, let me think. How could I solve this problem and find a way to get to school safely? I've got it! Would you fly me over the creek, Eve? Hunter, I'd love to, but owls can't fly very well in the rain. I'll have to stay under this tree until it stops. Oh well, I'm stuck. No use trying. Problems can be tricky, but you're smart. I know that together we can find a way across that creek. Okay, let me think some more. Hmm. Well, that won't work. Hmm, maybe. Whoa! What if I fall in? My mom said never to swim in rushing water. Yikes! I don't know what to do, Eve. I give up. Hunter, don't give up. Keep trying. Well, there is a brand new bridge up the creek. It's a longer walk to school than usual, but the beavers built it high and sturdy, so I'm sure it's safe and not flooded. Great job, Hunter. I think you've come up with a good and safe solution. Thanks, Eve. You're right. I'll head that way. Great. Since I can't fly very well in this rain, I'll walk with you. Boy, what a bridge. This is a safe way to cross the flooded creek. Yep, and to think I was ready to give up finding a way to get to school safely. But Eve, you reminded me to make sure I understand my problem. Then to think about different ways I could solve the problem. And finally, to not give up if something doesn't work. Just keep trying. Yep, you stayed flexible and I'm very proud of you. Have a great day at school. Learn lots. Thanks, Eve. I already have. Okay, guys, what'd you think about that video? It was pretty good. But I'm going to add one little step to their three steps. When you have a problem that needs solving, you need to stop. Stop so that you don't react to whatever the situation is. Stop so that you can take that big, deep breath. When you take a breath, it helps you get oxygen into your brain that will help you make a better decision. Then it's time to think of solutions. You think of solutions by saying the problem, thinking of the solutions, think about consequences to the solutions you pick, and then pick the right one. Pick the thing that's going to help you best. Pick the thing that will help you solve your problem. 
if you're not sure, even though you've gone through all the steps and you still don't know what to do, then seek help. Adults at the school and your parents were all here to help you learn and grow. When you have a problem that you just can't solve all by yourself, the problem may be too big, or you just haven't experienced it before and you don't know what to do, what the right thing is. Ask a trusted adult and they can help you solve your problem. So remember, when you have a problem that needs solving, stop, breathe, think. If you still can't understand what to do next, then seek help. Find help from a trusted adult.